What's going on guys? Tonight I want to talk about a product known as API Quick Start. I'm going to walk you through how to use API Quick Start. We're going to talk about some of the variables that come along with it, some of the competing products as well. Um, come over here and I'll show it to you. So API Quick Start has been in the hobby for a hot second. This started. This stuff is kind of known as like a fossil. A lot of these API products are super old school. Um, but they still work. So essentially what this does, it enables you to quick start your cycle essentially because a cycle will commonly take a couple weeks and what this is, is the pores to the nitrifying bacteria which create a cycle. Some of the competitors over here are, uh, this is kind of a newer brand, Fritz. This is their live nitrifying bacteria. This kind of does the same thing. Um, one thing to note, uh, Fritz claims that nitrifying bacteria has to be most of the time refrigerated. So, I mean, there's a lot of skepticism surrounding these products of Quick Start. Um, you know, the Seachem Stability, all these products, I will, I will say there's a caveat. There is kind of a conspiracy that these products don't work at all. My personal opinion, if you... Uh, I don't, I don't know, I'm on the fence because some of these products claim to be the, the spores to the nitrifying bacteria. Some of the products claim that you have to refrigerate this stuff. Some of them are dosed a lot differently. Like for instance, how to use the API quick start. The directions state, shake well, dose um, 10 milliliters per 10 US gallons. And it doesn't say to dose any more whatsoever. And what I also don't like about the directions is that once you dose this stuff, you're supposed to add an ammonia source, which I feel like they should, uh, these things should inform you of that on the directions because when dosing this stuff, you have to also source ammonia for the, for the spores to feed on to become nitrifying bacteria to eventually move its way to the nitrate in the cycling process. I know it all gets technical, but, um, my personal opinion on this product as like a review, I think it, it works, uh, a lot of people say it works pretty well. What I would do is dose it per uh, instruction and then I would also add like a pinch of fish food as an ammonia source. Um, you could also do a fish in cycle and like maybe add a small fish as the ammonia source. So that could be a guppy, uh, maybe like a, a rosy red minnow, just something with a small ammonia source to kind of, what happened? Hmm? Oh, to kind of give it time to, uh, to, to feed on the ammonia. So, um, but yeah, guys, I talked to you how to use it. The directions are super easy, add an ammonia source. Um, and this stuff should work well for you. API products have been around forever. Uh, let me know in the comment section if you have any questions on how to dose it. It's super easy. Like I said, you dose it 10 milliliters per 10 US gallons. Add an ammonia source. Um, there is some skepticism on if you should continue dosing it and how much. I wish there was more details on the bottle. I wish I could speak on behalf of that, but I shouldn't probably because it's my personal opinion. So guys, without further ado, uh, thanks for checking out the guide on API Quick Start. This product is a nitrifying bacteria. Uh, that helps cycle your aquarium. Thanks and subscribe.